I'm gonna keep this short and sweet. I don't know if this is focused on me. You can't become confident until you choose to be confident. You can't become confident until you choose, actively choose to be confident. You're letting past experiences, past mistakes, past failures shut you down. And you think lesser of yourself because of those mistakes. One day you need to look yourself in the mirror and say, I'm him or her. Because you put the work in mentally to get to that point. How do you get to that point? What type of work do you need to do? Visualize on a daily basis. Meditate. Actively and consciously understand what your goals are, then set actions to get to those goals. For example, if your goal is to win a state championship, what do you have to do to win a state championship? You have to show up day in and day out, put in work, study your plays, get behind your teammates, build relationships with your coaches, and most importantly, win games. But you have to do all the little things that build up to those points. So taking one step at a time, I'm not trying to cut corners, just staying focused, staying locked in. Confidence comes from competence and work. Competence and work. You get competent through your work. This summer I was on borderline delusion thinking that I'm the best trainer in the world. Nowhere even close. But I've taken steps in the right direction because I understand I wasn't competent enough. I was self-aware enough to say that to myself. And I pushed myself to the absolute limit where I feel like I've in some ways gone mad. But that's the level you gotta get to. If you're not willing, don't try.